how much exactly are we talking about? Covered in tattoos, are we talking from head to toe? Oh, head to toe, like your face has tattoos, your, your shoulders, your chest, your arms, all the way down to your toes. If you're talking about that kind of cover with tattoos, no, the majority of women would not like that, okay? They would not like that. They don't want to see a Mike Tyson tattoo on your face and then <laughs> tattoos everywhere, you know, um, to the point where they can't even see a piece of your skin, you know. Um, no, no, most women wouldn't, wouldn't like that. Now, of course, you know, there are women who have fetishes who probably have the same amount of tattoos. That's a totally different story. You know, they'll be attracted to that kind of niche fetish, but women in general wouldn't like that. Covered from head to toe, no. Okay. Now, if we're just talking about you've got quite a few tattoos on you, you know, maybe you've hit the double digits, but you're not covered head to toe, but you maybe got 10 plus tattoos on you. There are women who will like that, <clears throat> and there are women who wouldn't. But a lot of times, the most important thing in, in a situation like this when you have that many tattoos is what kind of tattoos are they? You know, are they tattoos, tattoos that have meaning to you? Or are they tattoos that are just there for the sake of having tattoos? Okay, so because a lot of times, even women who do like guys who have multiple tattoos may feel really like, okay, what the hell is a butt doing tattooed on your arm or something? <laughs> so it, it really depends. If they have meaning, to you, then it's going to mean a lot more to the women who like guys with tattoos. And even the women who don't necessarily like guys with that many tattoos, if you do have that many tattoos and they have meaning and they see that they have meaning, they speak to the person you are and the artwork is done well, they might actually not feel, they might not exactly feel like, okay, I'm going to completely shut him out. They might go, I don't really like tattoos on guys, especially that many, but they mean something to them and I can see that they do. Maybe I'll give them a shot. Okay, so there you have it. There you have it. Okay, um, lots of women have tattoos as well, and so you would not be in a rare category, you know, if you have lots of tattoos. But again, with a lot of women, it, it really depends on what the tattoos mean to you, how well the artwork is done, and how you carry the tattoos, you know. Sometimes you may not really have the body type for the tattoos. You might, you know, you may not carry them really well. Because that's important too. How do you carry the tattoos? Right? You may not have the the personality for those tattoos. In fact, those tattoos may seem off. They may not really gel with the kind of person that they perceive that you are. And if that's the case, then those tattoos are probably not gonna work for that very long because they're going, okay, you've got this, you've got this you know, this hawk tattoo or this lion tattoo on you. And I'm just getting the sense that you're more of a kitten, you know? So in a sense, so in a sense they can actually be detrimental to you, you know, if they don't match the person you are, both in a physical sense and in a personal personality sense, character sense, okay? So there you go.